Welcome back, my friends, to another YouTube video. Today is another light language video, and let's see what will come of this one. Asolo isala kolu kikala duma dila solo sisala ukulu kila isala sukoma ikala kono ikala kukuma kasala isala sono sala asolo dini dukulu kala akolo makala makolo ibala 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 Uvalo usalo sala samala dimli dukulu ke kala asolo si sala sana sukulu ke kala ivala volukulu isala susunu sikili dulu dilai dalakala ukukuma ikala kunu ikili kukulu asala sunu isala voluku Vili Valasala I can feel that that power, the energy is glowing at my heart center. Very powerful. Usually I, I know for the last couple of days, I'm still working on clearing the blockage on my heart chakra, um, my wings coming back out. I take that as a, a good sign. Wait, hold on. Um, big? tree i don't want to say redwood but could it be a, a redwood tree because it's the base is maybe an, it's either a redwood or an oak i know it's not a willow and there is a woman in a white shell dress Wiccan style, very witchy priestesses. <laughs> Tried to add the Y on it and failed. Priestess, ah, uh, some sort of nature ritual, but since I do not know enough about the different Wiccan rituals, I can't say what is really going on. I see fall leaves, like, okay, she just tossed them up. I, uh, I see torches, I believe. Uh, this could be a fall festival, not fest fall ritual of some kind. And I have no idea why my dog is barking. Oh my god. She's twirling around, I believe, like dancing, swaying, kicking the leaves up with her foot, tossing the leaves up around. I believe she is chanting something, but the vision is so far distant, I cannot even, I can barely hear the words, so I cannot make them out. I do know, feel that it's not a human language. Then again, there was how many on earth? Uh, 30, 30 different languages. Um, but I, I don't think it's on earth. I think it's somewhere else. Be it in another star system, uh, another planet, and the 5D uh, 
another uh, plane of existence? I, I don't know. But it feels like the colors are very vibrant, like more than what we have here with our 3D eyes. So I believe it's 5D, 6D, could be above that. I, I don't really know. It's, it's very vibrant, like it's very hard to describe. It's, it's almost like unreal because we have been stranded, stuck on this planet for who knows how long and there was these shifts going on, more people were waking up to become more passionate, serve others, not serve thyself. You are here to serve others, that is the way that I follow, serve others, not serve yourself. So who knows what this vision could mean. I am still learning the gifts and still learning about everything. So it's hard for me to decipher this, but who knows? It could be just, I, know, I do know since it's tied to the light language that I just did, this is not made up from the imagination. This goes back into visions from who knows well, your higher self, a pantheon that you follow, Hall and Guardian Angel, which um, whoever, whoever serves you as you serve others. Again, you're not here to serve yourself, you are here to serve others, and the four guardian angels serve you and other people as well, they are here to serve others. Okay, now I, I'm seeing like the shift of day from a time of day from sunlight to a freaking crescent moon facing well sometimes i flip images so it would be facing left the the points are facing left okay so he's doing some sort of magic ritual i don't know what's really going on but it's not the first, no, actually I take that back. It, it is the first time I, I'm having a vision such as this. Usually my visions are very veiled almost, uh, which means my third eye is opening even more as I raise to 5D. Right now I'm sitting at 4D, almost hidden 5D. I know I'm not on 3D, I never, I, I left 3D years ago, so this is just more validation that I am reaching 5D wavelengths, frequencies, vibrations, a lighter, brighter aura rather than darker. When you're on 3D, you are heavier colors. 4D is a little bit brighter, 5D brighter still continue onward. Um, and my experience with researching this from various sources throughout my time, and now it's being shown to me again, with that said, I thank you for your time, and until we meet again, my friends.